Hello! Welcome to what I assume is the final episode, Young Merlin. My name is Zach Rob. And this is for the Super Nintendo. Okay. Anyways, now that's out of the way. I spent some time uh, mapping out this, uh, mapping out this railway. Now the good news is we do start from where we left off. Um, so, yeah, let's just uh, get to it. Just be a straight shot all the way. It's all automatic turns. You boss two. How is this? My snow. Yeah. Oh, I was wrong. Huh? Oh, what the shit? Letter of the first. First. I mean, not that I ever really use it, except for like once, but here you can have it. Oh fuck, what the shit? The good news is it doesn't seem like it takes like a ton of hits to take him down. But that being said, unlike the first time I fought him, they're not. Oh my god, fuck off! Ah, there we go, got him. See, that's what you get for playing with Splooch. No, oh, no. 
<laughs> that was creepy. <laughs> creepy fingers. Alright. Now we're off to the final battle. Yeah! It's literally just a straight shot. Hourglass? No, lantern. Okay. I saved state right there, so I'm gonna keep going back and healing. But we're gonna do the we're gonna do the boss battle the way it should be and not save state our way through. Honestly, it's um the the first part is pretty easy. You can get through it without getting hit. Um all you know, it's nine eyeballs. But, uh, you just really need to use a decoy on the bottom one here. And then kill that, and then just kill the other two, and then rinse and repeat. And then it's just balloon, match balloon. I'm not really sure why balloon works on that, but... Oh, fuck. That's like instant death. All right, so don't let him touch you. That's the that that's the key to that. Decoy mirror apparently, according to the Nintendo Hotline, says it does not work here. So, well, at least for the final portion there. Ow! 
Rocket is equipped. Let's do hourglass, and then we'll just try. Oh, fuck off! I didn't even. I don't even think it matters that I have full health because he instant kills me, and he fucking pulled that off so fast. Like I didn't even have time to do anything.
Okay, I am going to save here because I don't want to keep... I, I can get through all the phases except for this final one just fine, so... Let's do this. top there. Ah. Look at him. Look at that face. Oh, I got the smooches. Oh, look, the meanies are gonna drop a stone on my head. Is it all just a dream? Nope. Okay, well that's uh, Young Merlin, and uh, that's quite an ending there. Um, you know, as far as an adventure game is concerned, this is a lot like, you know, King's Quest and those kind of games. And I think that, um, you know, for... It's funny, because I want to say, like, this is more kid-based, kid, kid -based, but, dude, there's no, there's no way. Like, those bosses towards the end are insane. Um... And then the minecart sections, I, I just absolutely despise. Everything else, like, oh no, it's cool. Um, the puzzles are pretty, they're pretty good. Uh, I mean, I, I don't think they're super difficult. Um, I think some of the, uh, I mean, honestly, the man, like, the manual coincides with the game, which I actually like, right? I think we often forget that back in the day, the manuals were a big part of the game. It's like the artwork, uh, you know, the stories that are inside of it and things like that. So, yeah, I it's a fun game. It's a game I never beat as a kid, so it's, it's great to actually finally get to the end of it. And that's it. Okay, I, I, I don't... I expect a little bit more, but you found all the hidden hearts. Hey, look at that. Send us a photo of the screen with your face beside it. If <laughs> you entered into the grand prize. Oh, it's a drawing. See your instruction manual for complete details on enter. You know, it's funny. There's a part of me that kind of wants to do it. Do a screenshot and then just send it and see what happens. Obviously nothing. You can re-return the sender, but... Um, yeah, I mean, it's a fun game. I, it would, do I recommend it? I, I don't know. It depends if, if it's your kind of game. You know, it's not, it's not like a hidden gem like, or anything like that. It's, it's janky, but, uh, it, it's got, it's got heart and it's got charm. And, uh, I think more games need, need that these days. So, 
All right. Well, with that being said, friends, uh, I think that's it. So take care of yourselves for your hearts, and I will see you in the next series, whatever that may be. So until then, stay magical. Bye-bye.